calculating the percentage of multiple variables into one single variable using the plus sign in SPSS and using the compute variable and I will also show you how to use the syntax editor or syntax coding coding for command here I have an exam result for 38 students numbered from 1 to 38 and a variables 76 variables labeled Q1 to Q76 and Q1 represent question number 1 to question number 76 so each student has attended an exam and in the exam there were 76 questions to answer multiple choice questions and the score for each question is either recorded as zero or one zero stand for wrong answer one stands for correct answer and if you want to calculate the percentage of the correct mark each individual student has obtained we need to use a formula to add up all the correct answers each student has answered divide that by the total number of questions which is 76 and then multiply that by 100 to get the percentage and here I'm going to show you how to do that using the plus sign so if we click on transform and then click on compute variable a window will appear in this window we are going to calculate the percentage for each percentage of correct answers for each individual student and generate a new variable call it percentage percentage we call it the percentage of the percentage and that will be more than enough and to do the percentage or to calculate the percentage we need to move all these variables the value within each of them into the numeric expression and then divide that by 76 questions and then multiply that by 100 so the first thing to do is to open a bracket and inside that bracket I'm going to click on question number one and drag it to the numeric expression and then click on the plus sign and do the same thing for the second questions and the third questions and so on since uh, we have 76 questions it will take a while to do that I had already typed these questions into a word document question number one to question number 76 and I'm going to copy these uh, select copy and then I'm going to delete what I have entered here and again I have to keep the variables within this bracket and then if I click on paste all the variable from Q1 to Q76 is, are added into the bracket with plus sign in between now we have the formula here telling the software to go and add the score from each questions to the second to the third and so on until 76 and to calculate the percentage we need to divide this by 76 because we have 76 questions and then multiply that using this uh, sign here by a hundred to get the percentage and once we click on OK the SPSS is going to generate a new variable and uh, calling it the percentage and if we look here at the percentage we can see a column generated 
and the percentage for each individual participant in this case the student is calculated next to the person so 81.58 percent and so on for the for the whole 38 students so this is the way to do percentage calculation for exam results or percentage calculation in general in SPSS another way to do the same analysis if we click in transform and then click on compute variable and instead of clicking hitting the icon for OK I'm going to generate another variable call it pers percentage 2 or percentage per 2 and then instead of clicking on OK I'm going to click on paste so what will happen with paste is will generate a syntax or command code in that command code we see here the code start with data set activate data set one point and compute and after the compute there is generate play, generate the software is saying generate a variable called pair one the pair one is will be equal to adding all the variable in between bracket dividing that by 76 multiplying that by 100 to execute this command just click on just select and highlight and select the uh, text and then click on this green button to run the command and if you click on that green button another new um, variable is generated calculating the percent percentage the advantage of using this syntax editor is that when you have to rerun the analysis or adding or changing variable within this changing record or values of each of these uh, um, questions the result or the value of it then you really can do uh, uh, rerun the analysis very quickly through this command uh, in which we can save this command file save as and I'm going to save it into desktop choosing the location of the place in which I can uh, some here or we'll leave it into the syntax leave it into the syntax here and I'm going to call it syntax number five percentage page one syntax number one percentage five if I say I click on save it will be saved again if I click on exit and reopen it again file open select the syntax and then go to the folder and click on the syntax 5 percentage again the uh, command code is saved and uh, this command can be executed at any time at any time when you open the data for this um, result of the exam so one of the advantage of the using the syntax editor it can be used to rerun the analysis and also when you add more record or modify record and uh, to show you how what is the really benefit of using this syntax if we have here student number let's say one and we change the score in number six to one and then modify this to one so we added two correct answer here three correct answer so we expect that the percentage will increase because the student has answered uh, more correct questions so the only thing is to do is to just select you have to select and highlight the text otherwise the command will not be executed click on the green arrow here and rerun the test and as you can see here the value of the percentage has increased from 81.5 to 85 as the student has an extra three correct mark 
So this a syntax can be used when you have an addition, when you have modify the data or add more uh, participant or students to this list or even you can delete the whole score and import a new store and new and new data uh, stored in your uh, files and then run the analysis rerun the analysis to calculate the percentage so here i had shown you how to calculate the percentage using the plus sign and then how to save the command for plus sign for numeric expression to do the percentage in the into a syntax editor syntax code and how to reuse this code for any modification to the data or addition to the